MindTap is an online student learning experience powered by you, the teacher. MindTap, for each National Geographic learning program, has its own special features, such as side-by-side -side activities, videos to engage students, or interactive elements to assess student learning. But there are many universal features of MindTap that will help you keep your students focused, connected to real-world content, and engaged in their learning. Let's familiarize you now with MindTap. First, let's show you the teacher view. The table of contents on the left allows you to navigate by chapter and by section. The search function lets you locate particular topics or, or standards. And the correlation tool allows you to find content based on state or national standards. The Resources tab on the right provides rich resources to help your teaching, whether it is general resources for the whole course or resources aligned with the specific unit or activity you are in. Now let's explore the Waffle menu as it provides important options. Let's start by exploring assignments. Here you find readings, assessment, and other activities to assign to students right in MindTap. You can preview these activities before assigning them. You can also share them in Google Classroom or copy them as a link to put in an email or an LMS. But you can assign activities right in MindTap so they appear in the student's learning path. You can assign to the whole class, to individual students, or as seen here, by groups, in order to differentiate instruction. Back to the Waffle menu. Here's where you can create those groups. But now let's look at the gradebook. The gradebook is where you will see your student's performance on each assignment. You can view the whole class or drill down into a student's data. This helps you understand where your students are in real time to make adjustments and differentiate lessons. The Reports feature is where you can see analytics of student engagement, looking at the whole class or zeroing in on a student to see what time they are spending on a particular MindTap activity. For some programs, you may also see reports on student proficiency for a set of standards. Now from the Waffle menu again. Let's look at course customization. Here, in many MindTap programs, you can drag and drop folders and sections to move around or hide content, making the course more personalized. You can also add your own web link activities. They will automatically appear in the learning path for students, and they can also be assigned. Okay, enough of you as the teacher. Let's dive into what the student sees by clicking on Launch Student Edition. MindTap is easy and intuitive for students. Where a student should go first is front and center. This always includes assignments that are due for the student, and in this case, the Library of Readings. Let's go ahead and jump into the library and open up one of the ebooks. The Reader in MindTap allows me to highlight. take notes, and have the book read aloud. History of the park. The human history of this natural wonder began long. For some MindTap programs, there is even a feature for students to change the reading level of the text. And some programs allow you to zoom in on the pages when necessary. And of course, the reader is just the beginning. The assignments and interactive elements of MindTap are what make the student experience come alive. And students in grades K through 2 will have the same features, but a different, more age-appropriate view. Color and interactive icons help students navigate on their own and help the teacher provide direction. MindTap is always evolving with new and upgraded features that will enhance your teaching and help keep your students focused, connected, and engaged.